inside the workshop from Northeast America. But, um, locomotives were being cut up every single week or two. Who? So, at the age of two or three every week. Eek. But, um, but, um. One locomotive survived. Apparently, the age of steam is over. Jeremy Asher probably presents 1972. South America, January 3, 1950. wondering what's that whistle sound coming far away and you may be wondering what, what whistle that is well that's the sound of of an sp4449 class engine in running along on the north north american main line north americans all around the world gather around to meet up with the 4449 but but apparently the little four but however, the big four 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 nine turned out to be to be a big four 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 four. As an as an as an example. But who is this guy who blew the whistle? Who did it? <laughs> Well, that can only mean one answer. Oh. Um, bang, gong, time, I bang on time, I bang on time, I bang on time. His name is Joseph. With his number 29. Okay, Joseph, the station's coming up. I want you to slow down to who, um, 14 miles per hour. You got that? Yes, I got that. Okay, it looks like the station is right here. So apparently we're gonna have to stop now. Yes, fireman. Um, I want you to climb on a cab. Stay here, Joseph. I'm getting out. A few moments later. Okay, I'm back. Let's go. What a nice day to trek down the line. Do you think? think I think that's what I meant. But however, let's go. How long that way? Something very interesting is going on. But apparently it's not something interesting. It is something else. But appar But apparently everything started to change. The gas steam turbines were, were collected and that decided 
that the locomotives of steam will sooner be scrapped. But how could it be scrapped like that? One of my last day to go and place to replace steam locomotives with modernization. Do you think? Yes, yeah, that's sure. Come on, Tim. Tim, you gotta pull the you gotta pull this freight way up. Uh, oh, come on! That's the spirit, Timmy! Uh, Meanwhile, in the shops. Dun, 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 dun. It looks like I'm gonna have to sit here. Uh, you're right, fireman? Yeah. Hey, what's, what's that for? Railway exhibition. Are you sure that's gonna make enough have money? Um, yeah. What the heck, man? Oh, come on. Let's just get in the... Let's just get inside Joseph's cabin. Just go to the opening and get a new exhibition when it opens soon. <laughs> and off they went to see the exhibition. Big white fog. Yes, it is. Here we are, the railway exhibition. Uh, there's nobody here. I know there's nobody here, but there may be a couple of friends by to help you. Who? <laughs> what was that? Well, what the heck was that? Was that any ghost? Huh? Joseph, my brother! Sir. <gasps> T Timmy! Oh, sorry, I mean, Joseph! I mean, no, it's morning. I mean, um, Mikey! Oh, oh, thank goodness. I've never seen you in a long time, brother. Me neither. So, Joseph, um, how'd you see in that documentary he filmed on TV that uh, locomotives were that steam locomotives were being scrapped and replaced with modernization. Yes. It's because of the new railway exhibition. What the heck is an exhibition? An exhibition is a pier. Are you seriously? Are are you hecking serious? I do not work for the Pier Marquette. I work for the Southern Pacific. See? It says Southern Pacific on my tender. Well, I, w well, I work for the Union Pacific, and that's not going to stop me. Well, apparently... <laughs> Are you sure that's going to work? Yeah, I'm sure that's going to work. So the both engines talked and talked and talked. Then one day, the mail came. Ah, I wonder what this mail is. Brandon Bay Shipping Co. I wonder what that means. But I think that I know what happened next. So many engines around the world got a message that they were being scrapped. But apparently, we try to survive many disasters as possible in order to keep the religion alive. Let's just say, hey, this juice is... 
but apparently, the, um, I have a lot of work today. So, will you wait on me? Yeah. Let me go change tenders. Wait a minute, do you actually change tenders? No. Come on, let's go. I'll show you a fun way to not get scrapped. Wait a minute, no, I'm a switcher engine. I don't need a tender. Guys! Guys! Who said that? Guys! I don't know who said that, but let's go home and check it out. Who said that? Who said that? Was it this poster of the American Civil War? Well, um, actually not. It is definitely not. Hmm. Help! I need somebody now. Oh, what's that sound? Sound. I hear Connor. Connor! Did you hear the sound of Connor? Yes. Where is Connor? I'm right here. Whoa. Connor. What the heck? What the heck, Connor? What do you want? We'll be scrapped. 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 Wait a minute. How do you know how we're going to be scrapped? Because dieselization, also known as as modernization will be taking over in a few months when the new railway exhibition is built. We will be scrapped to death by steam locomotives. I mean diesel locomotives. For example, bah! let's get out of here! Why? Why do we have to get out of here? I just heard the sound of a streamlined horn. That means a diesel locomotive is coming. Ah! Run away! So they tried to hide. From the diesel train. Shh. Are you sure this place can work out? It will. Yes, it will. We're still on the tracks into the scrapyard. Wait, we're in a scrapyard? Yes. Anyways, we got. I go. Bye. Now, as you may tell right now, how um, we're probably getting away. Da 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 That's right. John Cena! Wait, wait, wait. There's no John Cena. Ah! Okay. Time to get the heck out of here. Thank you very much, Joseph. You saved the age of steam from being scrapped. And that's the end of 1972.